It's cup final time in the Carabao Cup and we are the holders, we're looking to retain it and it will be our first bit of silverware of the season. Roll the intro. And we're not messing around straight into the action. This is how we line up. De Gea in goal, Lindelof, Smalling, Tuan, Zabian, Mitchell play, Herrera, McTominay and Pogba, Mata, Boonen and Dolberg all play for us. They line up in a 4-4-1-1. Berahino in front of Stephen Ireland, which is an odd choice. Shakiri, Juve, Allen, Wimmer, Adriano, Shawcross, Zuma, Flanagan and Butland in goal for Stoke. We have a very strong bench featuring Rashford, Lukaku, Nemanja Matic, Andre Gomez, Rojo, Damian and Sergio Romero. Sergio Romero probably is a little bit unlucky to miss out, but De Gea did play both cup finals. Um, uh, he deserves to win the trophy and I expect you to win it, is what I'm going to say. Someone looks stressed. Who's that looks stressed? Oh, Indy Boonen. Unlucky little man. Yeah, Sergio Romero is probably slightly unlucky to miss out, but David De Gea did play both semi-finals, so what am I doing here? That's not what I wanted to do. That's what I want to do. Assertively, there's a lot more to come from you. Go out there. There you go. That's sorted out the stressed out bit. Oh, you've left Eric Bailly out. He's just being rested. No more than that. So, yeah, we keep with Indy Boonen, who's got good goal-scoring form in this competition. Wembley looking magnificent, if I do say so. Um, we've got Dimitri Mitchell, who's been playing well at left-back. Dolberg comes back in up front after losing his place to Lukaku recently. Um, Mesut Ozil is cup-tied, hence why he's not playing. Otherwise, I probably would have played him just to get him involved in hopefully winning some silverware. But... Other than that, it's the team as you'd expect it. Herrera replacing Matic because we've got a big game coming up against Liverpool. McTominay gets a start alongside Pogba in the middle. And uh, 15 minutes in roughly and not a lot has happened. So that's a shame. I mean, it's a gale. There's a gale wind or gales here and she's thir feeling 13 degrees heat. Uh, the cup final is offered by Keith Stroud. 22 minutes in and nothing has happened. Although, there's a set piece here. Adriano back to Shakiri. Shakiri to Shawcross. It's fallen and it's been put in by Stephen Ireland, who is terrible. Stephen Ireland is a terrible, terrible footballer in the realms of Premier League footballers. He is awful. Um, Adriano flicked it back to Shakiri, who put it to Shawcross, and then Ireland picked it up and just placed it into the top corner. This is. Uh, Terrible. What's going on here? We might have to mix this up at half-time and go to a slightly more attacking formation. Our youngsters, oh well, Boone and Amata are not getting in the game. Obviously, Mata's not a youngster, but he's not terribly well at getting in the game at the moment. Might be a double substitution to give us a bit more attacking impetus for the second half, as not a lot is happening in this game at all. And we are five minutes away from going in 1-0 down at half-time because of Stephen fucking Ireland scoring a goal. I mean, he's awful. Let's look at him. He's terrible. He's absolutely terrible. He's 31. He's shit. He doesn't even play for Stoke in real life. They haven't picked him. They haven't played him once this season. That's how bad he actually is. Right. We're going to give him an absolute dressing down aggressively. Um, I expect to see a much better showing in the second half. We're going to give this 10 minutes. They've got until the 55th minute to sort their lives out and get us back into this game. Otherwise, there's going to be a lot of changes. And I'm looking at the front three. Really, that's where I'm looking. That's where I'm, the changes are going to come. Uh, Boone and Mata are both probably going to come off. As Stephen Ireland puts in another free kick. Smalling heads it clear. Shakiri Berahino back to Shakiri. It's 2 0 Stoke. This is an absolute, oh, it's an own goal from Chris Smalling. This is an absolute joke. So, what is going to happen? We're going to come off this. We're going to go into tactics. We're going to go to a four. No, we're going to guess. No, not that one. That one. The four, three, one, two. Mitchell, two, and Xavier Smalling, Lindelof, they can all stay there. McTominay is going to be replaced uh, by Matic. No, by Herrera. is going to go out there. Matic is going to come on for McTominay in the middle. Um, Boonen is going to swap with Mata. Boonen is then going to come off and be replaced by Lukaku. That's what we're going to do for now. And if we need to, we'll take Mata off and bring on Andre Gomez or bring Rashford on up front. But I'm hoping that this will give them the fire up the arse that they need. Because we're currently 2-0 down in a cup final to Stoke, which is rubbish. Absolutely terrible. Stoke are one of the only teams that have beaten us in the Premier One of a few teams, sorry, that have beaten us in the Premier League. As Shakira is there. Berahino fires it in. It was off Smalling. Captain for the day. Oh, disappointing. Totally disappointing. As we make the changes... 
Oh, lots of subs on and off. McTominay, so the two youngsters, Boonen and McTominay, come off. We go for a slightly more attacking formation. And uh, I know that you've got more people in midfield than us. So what? We're better footballers. We should be beating them. Right, Dolberg's going to come off um, and be replaced by Rashford as a poacher. Let's bloody do this. Come on. This is frustrating. So the subs are done. Rashford as a wonder kid comes on and Dolberg as a wonder kid goes off. De Gea with a long ball forward. Lukaku wins the flick on. Rashford's in. Straight away in behind. One on one. Sticks it in. Lukaku and Rashford up front as a strike force works really well. That is, I mean, it's a it's a horrible goal. It's a long ball forward from De Gea. Lukaku wins the flick on. Rashford times his run off the back of uh, Zuma, I think it is. Yeah, perfectly. And he sticks it past the outreach of Butland. It's 2-1. 25 minutes to go. We're in with a shout. 20 minutes to go. And Mitchell wins the ball back on the left-hand side. Up the line to Matter. Matters with some space. Ball through. Rashford. He's got Lukaku square. Into Lukaku. He shoots. It's a terrible shot. Really should have done better. Butland makes a good save. And we're, we are creeping back into this game. We just... Come on. Come on, boys. Lindelof. Back to Matter. Up to Mitchell. Mitchell to Pogba. Back to Mitchell. Back to Pogba. Into Matter. Rashford's in. Shoots Butland with a save. It's a good move. And we... We are getting into this. We just need one more chance, I think. One more chance to fall to Rashford, ideally. He is on fire in front of goal. Matter. Ball through. Lukaku. He split the defence. Lukaku. Oh, Butland. Just plucks it out of the air. We've got to do better in these chances. Matter. Comes through. It's a goal. Rashford gets the equaliser. 2-2 in the cup final. 15 minutes to go. We are getting on top of this game now. Take that, Stephen Island, you wanker. As the goal comes in, Rashford fires in the rebound. It was a great little finish. 2-2. Rashford has turned this game around. 10 minutes to go. Can we nick a winner? Come from behind in the cup final. At Wembley. In front of our fans as Mitchell has a throw. To Pogba. To Mata. Shot. Butland catches quite easily. And I think Stoke... It still said Stoke bought on Jeff Cameron. Which is... Uh, Interesting. As Berahino comes forward out to Stephen Island. Stephen Island crosses block. Joe Allen and Herrera intercepts it. Finds Rashford. Lukaku. Matters made a run. But that's Herrera. Herrera over to Rashford. Infield. Oh, he couldn't slip it through to Lukaku or Matter. And a long ball forward from Tupo Motting will find nobody. To Nzebi. Back to De Gea. Out on the left to Mitchell. Up to Pogba. Pogba's pass is blocked, but Matter's there. Looking for Lukaku, who's in behind. Lukaku shoots. Oh, my God. Butland. What a save again from Jack Butland. Matter with the ball into the near post. It's cleared. And Herrera on the volley. The goalkeeper sees it go wide. Jack Butland is keeping them in this game. Totally. It is totally all down to Jack Butland at the moment. As they bring on Josh Tymon, the young fullback. Um, and then they've pushed him up to left wing. Interesting. Um, taking Adriano off. But we're into injury time. It looks like it's going to go to extra time unless we can nick something here. Lukaku. Back to Mata. Mata shoots. Mitchell. The youngster from range. Butland makes an easy catch. Again, we just keep kicking it, like shooting a bit too close to him. If you look at these chances, we have been absolutely bossing it. Four clear-cut chances to their none. Mata. And Herrera. He's through. He's hit the post in the last minute of injury time. And Herrera has hit the post. So unlucky. Lindelof with the throw to Lukaku. Cross in. Rashford can't beat it in the air. Matic picks it up. Matic to Pogba. Pogba couldn't get there. Eric Peters comes on for John Flanagan. It's the end of 90 minutes. It's been a hectic game. Oh, my word. Talk to the team assertively. Keep going. It's time for him to dig in and give what you got. We deserve to win this match. Let's go and do it. We do. That second half. Since Rashford came on and the changes were made... We have bossed this game in its entirety. The only thing I haven't thought of is, have I done any sort of opposition instructions? We have. We've done a little bit. Let's just see if he wants to update them. He does. So we'll go into there. We'll confirm those changes. Can we nick that goal? I mean, the stats are incredible. Look at these shots. They've had six shots. We've had 21 with 13 of them on target. This is unbelievable. We really do deserve to be winning this game, I think. Who's, I mean, Zuma's been standout for them. A uh, right back, they're playing him now. Interesting. Uh, Steven Island. Okay, yeah, let's not talk about that. And there's not much happening in extra time. Lukaku has been very disappointing up front, but he has got an assist. As it's half time in extra time, we kick off the second half. I'm going to 
what shall I tell them? What shall I tell them? Let's just uh, let's just encourage the whole team. We'll just encourage them. Berahino's gone off injured, so is that they're down? Are they one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten? They're down to ten men. It's just the double injury there put me off. They are down to ten men, and they have a free kick. Shawcross looks to Josh Timon on the left hand side. Ball forward to absolutely nobody. Smalling will pick this up. There's ten minutes left in extra time. Pogba, Mata, Herrera up to Lukaku. Lukaku is tackled, it's a ball forward, but Chupe Motting just lets it run. I think he must have been offside as we find Pogba into Mata to Rashford. Rashford runs forward with it, tackled by Stephen Ireland, who's having a bloody game of his life. Smalling with a good header, Mata looking for Rashford again, but we couldn't get it through. Joe Allen to Chupo Motting. Chupo Motting, ball, it's a terrible ball bust. Lukaku puts in Rashford for the hat-trick. He's gone from range and he's put it over. And I don't think I've ever been so tense about a bloody League Cup final. The Carabao Cup final. don't think I've ever been this tense about a League Cup final. If it was the FA Cup or the Champions League, something like that, I could understand. But it's going to go to penalties, it looks like, unless we can nick this ball here. Lindelof, long ball forward. Lukaku gets on the end of it. He's got a man in the middle. He goes on his own. Butland sees it, goes past his post. It's not even a corner. And it goes to penalties. So Lukaku and Mata are on the pitch. I'm going to put Rashford as the third taker. Then Pogba, I'm just a bit worried about Herrera's injury. But he does have the best finishing out of everyone else available, apart from Mitchell. But his composure, um, I'm, I'm going to go with Matic. And then I'm going to go Herrera. And then it's going to be Lindelof. And then it's going to be the youngster Mitchell. And we'll see how that goes. In... To penalties we go. First penalty shootout in Football Manager 18. Chupo Motting is up first for Stoke. De Gea gets back to his line. Chupo Motting. It's saved by David De Gea. Lukaku, our leading man up front. Not had a brilliant game but did get an assist for one of the Rashford goals. Sticks it in and beats Butland who goes the right way. Mata. Up he comes in the new ABBA format. Mata. Oh, what a penalty into the bottom left corner. Jeff Cameron, the USA international for Stoke City against Big Dave. Big Dave loves to save. He loves it. It's 2-0 up in the ABBA process. Steven Ireland, he's had the game of his life. But will he miss his penalty? He doesn't. He sticks it into the bottom corner. Marcus Rashford steps up with the penalty. Here we go. Marcus. Oh, he's been saved. It's hit the post, actually. I thought it was saved, but he's hit the post. Paul Pogba, Paul Pogba, come on, come on Paul, big money signing, he's missed and hit it straight at Jack Butland, Kevin Vimmer, he's got the penalty, left footed, he's put it wide, he has put the penalty wide, we're still 2-1 up on penalties, who's coming up next for Stoke, it's a long walk for someone, Eric Peters, Eric Peters takes the long walk, they've brought him on at centre back, He's pretty pretty healthy and, and fit with stamina. So he's obviously been bought on as a penalty taker. Eric Peters, he must score. He has scored. He's slotted it away. Absolutely lovely. And I think this is the deciding penalty. I can't... I, the ABBA is confusing me. I can't remember who's taken what, in what order, and what number penalty we're on. But it's Nemanja Matic. Steps up. The big Serbian. The ball is on the spot. Butland is in the goal. Nemanja Matic. Just leather it as hard as you can down the middle. Oh, it's saved by Jack Butland. And Herrera. He's got a stub toe and he wanted to come off. And Herrera. Oh, he's missed as well. Jack Butland saved it. This means Stoke have the chance to win. Stoke have the chance to win the League Cup. And it's Kurt Zuma who's had an outstanding game for Stoke. Which means he's surely going to score. Kurt Zuma with the ball on the box. David De Gea jogs into his net. Will he nip the winning penalty? He's blasted it absolutely very wide and uh, it's horrible. Joe Allen, the Welsh Pirlo, saved by David De Gea. We've got a chance to win it. This penalty shootout is going on miles. Who was next? Lindelof. It should be Victor Lindelof making the walk from halfway. And it is. And up after Lindelof is Dimitri Mitchell, I think. Just score it and give us the win. Victor Lindelof. 
He scored it. We've got our first silverware of the season. Man United lift the League Cup. Look at them all. There they are with a trophy that looks unbelievably white. The confetti falls. We get the win. Absolutely brilliant. I'm actually very happy that we've won. Look, I mean, we deserve it. Look at those stats. It's an unbelievable, unbelievable thing. Rashford, Pogba, Matic and Herrera all missed their penalties. Uh, Chupo, Motting, Cameron, Vimmer, Zuma and Joe Allen missed theirs. Terrible penalties with some very tired legs. Ah, oh, very good. Passionately. What a comeback. That was superb. You should all be very proud of yourselves. Well done. And the youngsters, Mitchell and McTominay, did play their part, which is good. And, oh my word, we're going to end the video there. That was a roller coaster of emotions. But thank you so much for watching. Leave a like because we won our first bit of silverware. Leave a comment and let me know if you'd have done, done, done things differently. But for now... I'm off to go and have a glass of water and a lie down. I'm out. Cheers.